hi guys happy sunday you thank you so much for tuning in to this uh video today and uh, yeah, it's a sunday it's already in the afternoon and i'm going to church i'm going to be meeting again tish um at essen so yeah today the service is in the afternoon still at essen um but Usually this area that I live in that we live in right now is uh, is usually notorious for Like the train the trains not showing up. So the train that I was supposed to take for 1235 is not there. I have to wait another hour, but I have called Mark and uh, he has been kind enough to say that he's coming to drive me to the main train station and then from there I can take the train to Essen and then from there I will meet with Tesh. Yeah we can go to church together and then just see how the rest of the day will go so i will catch up with you guys later to Duisburg city center you can see the writings right behind me so I think I'm on time the service is supposed to start I'm not on time the service is supposed to start at uh, 2 it's now 1 1 it's 1 I have one hour yeah I should be there on time Tesh will be at Essen in the next 30 minutes so I need to find the next connection to Essen and then proceed and I will see you guys later. I just wanted to remind you of this city that I, I haven't been here in the city center or made any videos from here for a long time. Or rather since I came, I've never really come to this particular point. But yes, this is our small city of Duisburg. And I'll see ya. so it's late in the evening uh, back to Duisburg uh, city center and today there is like a street food fair in the like in the uh, like yeah in the main street which is called the Cornish Trasse in uh, Duisburg so I'm waiting for Mark here we are meeting and then just gonna like um, walk around uh, sample some dishes and find something to eat it's already a little bit late but um the time has been the clock has been reset today so we are uh, like two hours behind before like uh we were one hour behind compared to like the east african uh time uh but now we are two hours behind so that means that when right now i'm assuming it's like 6 p.m then it means that in kenya is 8 p.m coming a little bit tricky but today I was really excited because my daughter <laughs> I don't know she's just growing up so fast she's in grade 3 okay finishing grade 3 but uh, wow she's just learning like uh, developing new skills every day or maybe becoming more techni technologically savvy so she was you know somebody was texting me through my mom's phone and I was like okay fine it sounds like her but uh, her spellings are correct and everything the punctuation is where it's supposed to be and she was just like hi mom i made you a pot i love you uh, let's uh, see you next friday because normally we speak every friday and then she decided to call uh, but that was really lovely so that, that was uh, like the highlight of my evening today just uh, her calling me at random because today is sunday we normally speak on fridays and she looks forward to every friday but she's decided to call me today yeah, those are the chronicles of a mom living like uh, away from the child. But to be honest, I have a really intelligent child and I just can't wait for the next time I get to see her. So like, see you later guys. Just
and uh, we are looking for something to eat. What are you gonna eat? I don't know what is here. <laughs> we are looking. We will find. That is. <laughs> Different version from a French fries. Not bad, really. <laughs> <laughs> Not bad at all. From the Mausespeck. Can you or so I ended up getting some Indonesian food for dinner called rendang. Yeah, just a small portion was about 10 euros, but I was really hungry and the potatoes that I had eaten earlier were not enough. And yeah, the food was really spicy, but the fair had foods from various parts of the world, Mexican, African, Indonesian, whatever and it was just yeah it was really worth it so after our simple dinner we just sat down and watched people dance their way into the evening actually it was so much fun and uh, such a good ambience and oh my god that is the most fun i've had in a long time just relaxing and of course afterwards we took some photos for memories to just wind up the evening and that was it <laughs> it was snack time so we decided to get some marshmallow for dessert it's um what can i say it's 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 just a nice place to walk especially around especially today when the weather is so nice yeah i know i'm all, i'm even overdressed but yeah the weather is really nice uh but okay people are starting to leave the streets but yeah it was a nice food festival just to a place to hang out for the weekend so i'm looking forward to the Christmas market which I hear it's gonna be I think on the same yeah of course here around the same place but I'm, I look forward to testing the glue wine <laughs> yeah so basically that was it for this mini walk and then time to go home it's already I don't know ah, ah it's it's not yet even seven yeah it's like 6 30 but i think the party is over the music is down people are closing up and yeah we're just about to go back home